Solomon in the red, white, and blue. Round one, scheduled for 12, Indio, California. Virgil, too, too long, so he's shifty. In describing Solomon, he's shifty. He starts swinging away. I'll brawl with him. Easier said than done. Good upper body movement. Jack to the chest. Jack on, even though he probably probably didn't win. I mean, he, uh, he did some good things. He usually has a busy jab, but so far, He's been reacting. Nice right hand by and, 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 and be cagey and cute in there, but being able to take Comes back, people. Get those cameras back. Since 2015, he's very grateful to get this opportunity and vowed to make the most of it as Ortiz had. Well, generally speaking, it's usually easier to hit. Power, but he had great upper body movement and he used uh, feints. He got injured tonight. Well, we touched on this in the beginning of the talk. Oh, that right hand. Left hook right on the temple from Ortiz Jr. Good right uppercut. Yeah, don't expect Solomon to keep up with the punches of Ortiz. He's just looking to land the cleaner shots and not. not. And he moves hands up nicely. He hasn't been. Oh, he didn't roll well with that one. And Power jab being landed there. A la Kovalev. Actually, this. Solomon like Ortiz. legs don't look right. Ortiz is. He wants to come in, in that oh. overhead right angle to land it on top of Solomon's head. South. Heavy handed shot from Ortiz. There's that pendant right hand and Solomon's in trouble. He might go down again. He does take it. Solomon's got to show the referee something. He takes a knee again. That's the third knockdown. They'll wave it off twice, but it was all she wrote, the beginning of the end, as the 21-year-old Virgil Ortiz.